it's a big statue of something going. Although it looks like uh, it's it's not like a human statue. It's it's like if you were to take a water elemental and make it into a statue, badly. Okay. So is that what I get with the magic glasses on? No, you haven't even activated those. This is just without the magic glasses. Okay. Uh, so make a note that you're using yet another charge. Yeah. And uh, right. Give me an analyze magic as you see lots of interesting magic stuff, including something that's moving the, the statue toward the lake, like a, like a chain almost, but it's made of magic. Yeah, got it. Um, this seems to be a little different than what you were expecting uh, or what you're experiencing, rather, although it would be super handy if you had somebody else who, from white AI you could look at because you can't see yourself as well. This seems that it's undergoing some sort of metamorphosis. Uh, it was uh, the sewer statue, and now it's becoming something else. You're not sure what because you didn't make it at half or negative 30 or anything super cool like that, but it's becoming something else. And so that's the reason for its declining power as it's changing into something. Whereas white seems to just be on decline and you're not sure why something bad is happening. Okay. So what's this chain thing then? It's like a magical chain and you're thinking that uh, it's not coming from the lake. It's coming from the statue thing. And maybe it's very, very slowly, like snail's pace, hauling itself toward the center of the lake, which gets quite fucking deep after a while. Quite. It's trying to get as far down into the earth as it can. Or, or into the center of the lake as it can, yes. Okay. Oh, of course, it might just be confused thinking it's heading back toward the sewer, and in reality, it's not. Maybe it needs help. Or maybe it's like a baby bird falling out of a nest, and it just needs to be stepped on. Yeah, but I'm not, I'm not sure if I want to do that, considering that the, this being in a metamorphosis could be what is draining what's power. It could be a wild number of things going on. Right, exactly. I don't. I just don't know. Yes. So, all right. We'll come back out. Um, and yeah, it, it shows him. It shows Alex underwater, still drinking whiskey. And as he comes up, <laughs> the whiskey bottle is the first thing, and then the water continues moving down past his head. Find anything? He says, uh, flopping around like a dead fish on top of the water and kicking you in the face with a fin. I'll relate back to then what, what I found. Huh. Tricky. Was there anything at the center of the lake? It was quite far. 53 meters. Well, at the deepest spot. I guess that might not be the center. Mm. Okay. Are we done here then? Yeah. I, I don't have any more ideas, so... Let's see. want to see what's at the center of the lake. Dun, 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 dun. Good day. That would definitely be a scuba diving type role to get down that deep. There is pressure at that deep, and you also have to know the timetables because otherwise you will uh, maybe get the bubbles in the blood, which will give you amazing amounts of pain and shit like that. So I personally recommend uh, uh, just scuba boy go. Yeah, I'll make it one of these times. No, you won't. <laughs> <laughs> Not with dice like that. Yeah. Uh, 
So are you going to go for it and let the air two rest up and stuff and let Alex contemplate what's uh, going on? And how was he drinking whiskey through his mask or was he pretending to, or was he sucking it through the mask somehow? Who was that masked man anyway? Hmm. He was he. He was highly paid Alex Kinley. Highly hmm. paid? I don't know that. So go ahead and give me a scuba roll to see if you can plumb the depths of this lake. Is there timetables and shit like that involved when you go this deep? Oh, so close. Wow, you kind of suck at scuba, you think, as you are working on getting uh, uh, nitrogen bubbles into your bloodstream. Uh, I mean, so much pain. Mm. Yep, not today. No problem. Uh, yeah, you give yourself a nice case of the bends and shit, and you're what? laying on this. Yeah, that's what nitrogen bubbles in your bloodstream do, yep. is give you the bends. But Pretty much it cripples you for life. You know, I don't like anything. Just flap around like before. Because yeah, you were trying to dive deep, deep, deep. I did warn you about this repeatedly. <sighs> <laughs> Time well, you should heal stuff. pretty well. Yeah, yeah. It's just amazing, blinding pain for, you know, a couple hours as you're... Uh, oh, give me a willpower times five to ever heal. There you go. <laughs> as there is shit going on with white here. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, Do I just re-roll the scuba? With scuba that low, I'm hoping your willpower times five is higher. It's a hobbyist scuba. Yeah, sucky scuba. Not recommend. You should be looking at a shallow coral reef at hobbyist as opposed to <laughs> going down somewhere deep enough that you have to go up in stages and shit like that. Okay. Um, right. Willpower. Made it. After a couple of hours of screaming your head off, you feel better. It's super painful. You didn't really get to find anything down there. Maybe you could convince Dana Zul to go for the scuba. Oh, no. Or not. And it Alex was... Kinley's looking at it like it may be a demon suit. There were Indeed. have been no scuba opportunities in my life until right yeah. this week. Hmm. That's not true. We had the scuba gear in the sewers. It didn't go well. Yeah. She has a point. So, uh, right. What do you guys do now? Back to the dragon. To the dragon. <laughs> dragon. Dragon. Give me them rolls. Okay. Efficient spell. By a lot. Smash metal. Whoops. What did I do? I double rolled. Okay, so I failed one. If you double roll, you always take the top roll. Right, but I was going to do it again. Right, then you roll a new time. You don't just get the double roll. <sighs> yeah, I know, life is bad. That's... But you'll eventually make it, and then everything will be better, and you can put flowers in your hair and dance yeah. around naked, which will terrify your children. Why is daddy going yeah, crazy? Has he played too much anytime, anywhere? And oh. his head explodes at last. Everything is better now as blood and brain shower you. Let's see what happens to him. Foe extra damage. Whatever you, uh, let's see, if you're not fighting any foes, you can just look relieved and get on with your life. Your miserable, <laughs> bumbling life. There you go. Try the mana trickle. See, the fumble deck is not so bad because you're hitting uh, many of them. Fail, sometimes. fail, 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 fail. Made it. That's a once a day type spell, yeah? Yeah. Cool. Right, you trickle some shit back in, and after a certain amount of time, you can try it all again as uh, Alex Kinley just stares into the distance, waiting for you to die. Horribly. I, think I, I think I have to make a meditation. Meditation? 
Cool. So that's not going to go well. Yeah. No. Yeah. Okay. Cool. And you're done? Done for the day. Right. What do you guys wish to do now? It appears that there are mysteries that you're having problems plumbing the depths thereof. I don't know. I'm, uh, I've, I don't know. I've got no avenues left to explore, so for, for right now, can't think of any. Are you ordering food, Matt? I'm trying to. I like you. Okay. It's going to get a couple of burgers. You're right with it. Um, I'd rather get one of those calzone things again than the burger. I was I was going to order from a different place so we can get a variety, and they don't do calzones. They do pizza. Hmm. Okay. Would you rather have a pizza? Pardon? Would you rather have a pizza? No, burger's fine. Glenn wants to sleep and then try scuba again tomorrow. <clears throat> Cut to. Right. Well, he's definitely on it. Well, while, while uh, Matt worries about the food, this is a great time to try dying again in scuba. Yes, you can actually kill yourself in this. It is possible. It's unlikely, but it is possible. I am giving you fair warning. You are trying something well beyond your miserable scuba skill. You're not doing cave diving, at least, which is good. Made it. Wow. You go down to the bottom, and you only have a few minutes of bottom time due to the amount of pressure. They have tables and shit you can consult. The deeper it is, the less time you have down there. You look around, there doesn't seem to be jack shit down here other than whatever is this deep in a normal lake. Um, it's a pity you don't have the full you face mask. The glasses. Glasses. Yeah, what a bummer you think as you swim back. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. What I meant to say is it's a pity, but you extricate yourself from the lake and you're clutching your head and thinking, why does, why is everything so goddamn hard? Alex is sitting there with the glasses up on his head <laughs> <laughs> and the mask just kind of laying casually like, I dropped this. I don't care about it enough to pick it up. <laughs> so if you want to put on the mask and stuff uh, some time can go by and then you can try to get in one last scuba roll where you're wearing the glasses you're wearing the mask you're scuba down and you kill yourself okay Two scuba dives a day is about as much as you want to do, especially in something this deep. Three is possible, but not recommended. I've hung out with too many goddamn scuba instructors. Okay. I switched the mask. Uh -huh. uh, special glasses. Uh-huh. Underneath the mask. Uh-huh. I figured they were under it as opposed to over it, although over it's funnier. So, no problem. Give me the scuba roll to get back down in the middle of the lake without dying or knocking off your mask and losing the special goggles. And, oh, my God. You get down there. You activate them. It costs you one magic point to activate shit. Uh, that's about five charges off Pete's goggles and shit. He'll, he can find out when next to Cool. Hmm? Oh, sorry, four, I was estimating. And you look around and give me an analyzed magic roll there, Scott. Mm. There's a lot of pretty lines and colors and shit like that. It makes you want to start doing uh, LSD. It'd make your life better to do LSD than look through the goggles. There is something going on. Oh, yeah, it's something. All right. It's a pity you have no clue what. But uh, that's probably not important. Reroll. Oh. Spending a hero point? Yeah. Ah, ah, ah. I mean, oh. And 
I'll play my reverse dice card to get a success. Well done. Right. There seems to be the end of like a black chain thing that comes from the approximate direction you came from. Like something went dunk and is slowly dragging itself there. There doesn't seem to be anything innately magical about the center depths here or anything like that. The only the main magic is something is hooked in and is using that to drag itself into the briny deeps, so to speak, although it's not really that briny because it's freshwater like. Okay. So I definitely think the statue is moving itself rather than something Super dragging slowly. the statue. Super slowly. But you're suspecting that uh, the rock will come and find a way to get it out and drag it off before it can make it to wherever it's going, because that's the kind of guy he is. <sighs> okay. Yeah. Uh, I start heading back. No problem. You take, uh, with your successful scuba, you take the appropriate amount of time to surface, which is a long time. And, uh, yeah, you get rid of all that nitrogen narcosis out of your bloodstream. And then eventually you head back to the uh, shore. The only bad thing is that, uh, if I'm not mistaken, this is the kind of lake that people motorboat in. There's a lot of hilarious near misses and shit like that as people are wondering what the fuck a scuba diver would be doing in here. But eventually, you make the shore. You see the other two. They look at you. You look at them. There's oh, a lot of going on. Did it work? Did it work? Mm. It's trying to get to the center. There's nothing obvious there. But that is where the magic chain is going. Blah. Hmm. I know it's a black chain. You did say black. I did. Is there a black AI? No, I don't know. Well, there may be. Who can say? Are usually people who have been trying the glasses is usually like things that are affected by the white magic have white auras or something like that? Or doesn't Sometimes the, the spell effect that is going on bears no relation to the AI color that's doing it. But you'd probably find out more if you took the glasses, spent another charge, and used them on Alex Kinley. Ooh. That could be the whole thing there you're thinking in your head. Or if nothing else, you'd look super stylish in these really freakishly ugly glasses with the big thing at Chris poking out the side. Oh, yeah. Glenn, it. you probably are better at analyzing magic than I am. Hey. Mm, not great. Mm. Can Alex, can you look at yourself in a mirror with the glasses on? The mirror may may mess up his readings, uh, whereas if both of you took a turn at it, you might be able to tell him more about himself than he could about himself. Let's take a shot. Hmm. Alex looks at you and thinks about whiskey. Uh, yeah, well, I think I already... I'm not sure if it's worth you guys doing that because I think I already know what, what part of this is. Um, no? Well... <laughs> yeah, well, I'm, I'm guessing that the fucking demon has something to do with this. I already know about the demon, so... Which demon? The demon that's connected to me somehow. Ah, well, if they took a look at you with your with the glasses, they could tell you if that has anything to do with it. Yog Sathoth. Hmm? Yog Sathoth. The, the mysterious wood carving from where when we woke up. Yeah. What about it? 
Is that the name of your demon? Oh, no, no. It's just some kind of demon a... worm thing that's connected to me somehow. You have to take your magic sword and kill it or something? No, that's someone else. <laughs> 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 Sounded like you. No, oh, no, no. Someone else that needs killing, not the demon. Well, the demon probably needs oh. killing, but... Yeah. Okay. I kind of liked him at first, but if this is what's happening, then probably need to kill it. Hmm. So... Are you trying the glasses on Alex, then, to see what you may see? Yep. Excellent. Roll that shit. And another charge goes away, Alex. We have to hold track so we can get him back to Pete. Empty. Empty will probably be where it's at. After about 20 charges, I'll just tell you it's out, but I'm not sure how many it has. I failed. Cool. Do you want to try letting Dana have a go? I, I hand him over. It's all up to you, Dana. This role can completely define your life from this point on. Well, well, I'll just give it a try. Nope. Or wait. Damn. All the way scrolled, but unless it was an amazing role. Nope. I don't know that much about magic. Got it. Well, you can continue handing them back and forth between you and Glenn until one of you figures it out if you really wanted to, but it would just drain the charges. Yeah, you can get another Chris, right? Yeah. It's honestly only 50 silvers. It's just a pain in the ass to get it and get it installed, that's all. Oh, yeah. Do we do we remember what the wood burning said in the the theater? It's in the chat, but you've got to open up. Yeah, I, I tried scrolling. I, say, I, I gave it to you guys so you could copy paste it into a text file or something. Well, I thought it would stay, but it's too wow. far up now. I'll work on that. Okay. Uh, Glenn, do you want to? Try it again, because like this is a really big clue. We've been trying to figure out exactly this. Mm hmm Okay. It all comes down to Glenn's lack of knowledge, and if not, it comes down to Dana Zool's lack of knowledge. Alex looks at you, and he seems constipated. Hmm. That's your problem. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Is Probably. Something. Oh, there it goes. At last. I made it. Good news, <laughs> bad news. Okay. Uh, give me a Sandy roll there, Glenn. Yeah. You get to see some sort of demon on Alex's shoulder. It seems to have nothing <laughs> at all to do whatsoever with any of the shit that's going on with Alex, but it does cause you a Sandy roll because Alex is a bad man. Ain't it? All right. It's zero. You go, hey. It's just kind of a weird thrashing worm-like thing on his shoulder. I, I point at him and I shout, Demon! Yeah, I know. <laughs> I don't know. Now, uh, did you make it by anything special on your magic thing there? Okay, analyze magic? Because that's that quite a good roll. You have 24 or higher in your skill? Yeah, that's half. That's perfect. Right. What you find out is that the source of power uh, for the Highlander stuff, which uh, Alex seems to be able to normally carry into other... Uh, zones and shit has literally been cut off the source. In other words, the problem isn't here. It isn't with brown AI. It isn't. The, it's white AI seems to have literally left the world. Blah. Right. Well, that's a whole fucking waste of time then. All isn't right. That what, isn't that what your priests were trying to tell you? Oh, yeah, but they'll, like, find out why. And we've yeah. just gone complete full circle in, a, like, two weeks and found out wait, nothing more. Wait, we already what, knew we fucking left the world. We just don't know why. So, what's, what's with the demon? Don't know. Don't really care. <laughs> it just appeared there? Uh, who knows? I don't know how long it's been there. I don't know how long it'll stay there. I kind of like it. Empathy? On Alex? Sure. Yeah. I'm an amazing actor, by the way. <laughs> yeah. I was going to say, good luck. Yeah, I fail. He can be telling you that he is you and you would believe it at this point. Oh, yeah. 
Because <sighs> that that would kind of be my intuition that it has something to do with the demon. Oh, also with your analyze magic at uh, half, you're thinking that every now and then the willpower roll needed to make shit happen, unless the situation is corrected, in which case, no matter how low it's gotten, will immediately reset itself into happy fun mode and stuff. Will go down and become harder and harder. I, I could have told you that without a fucking roll. It's the hose. Yeah. But, of course, if he was to kill Batman and steal his power, then he would not have any of these problems. He'd have new, interesting problems, especially since you're the Riddler. <laughs> What's true? Not the Riddler. Right, right. That's uh, the whole riddle there. Uh, Who's the Riddler? It's me. I'm French. The French Riddler. It's horrifying. Hmm. I've been thinking about a change of scene. <laughs> did you find that text, Dana? I did. I'm trying to clean it up to copy it into the chat again <laughs> so we can scroll it. Yeah, chat likes to automatically break it up into pieces for some reason. Tear my life into pieces, etc. Uh, this is the last report. There it is. Mm -hmm. right you guys can feel free to copy paste that into text files or whatever you feel like if you'd like to reference it whenever you feel like in the dead of night and stuff can, like uh, that. Post it on the interrealm boat board. Possibly a really good idea, sure. So, um, slay the enemy with the great sword. At least he lose his endless horde. That could be referring to uh, Zog and the sword I own. Um, they shall become, when the daughters of Dionysus meet, that could be something to do with um, the girl who has no name and her lover, or something to do with a child, or something. Uh, bride of metal, bride of bone. Ah, yeah, there you go. That definitely, the first one is to do with Yana and her, her partner. Because her partner used to be um, an android or something, didn't she? Demon. So, bride of metal, bride of bone. That would be uh, Mildred and her partner. One a circuit, the other is the other a throne. Oh, that's right. Two girls would be got bloody ivory skin. Ivory would be white? Yeah. All a part of her twisted dream. Oh, fuck. It may, if this says that to be a fucking dream sequence, I'm coming for you, Logan. <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm one, one of three mothers to steer destiny. That's the little kid. So the three... The third mother could be white. So white herself, Mildred, and her partner. So that's three mothers. A great danger as she lacks empathy. Yeah, well, I don't think any of them have empathy. <laughs> <laughs> so, Yana, These are not nice women. None of, none of the women in this campaign, aside from Dana, are particularly nice. Dana's a bit iffy on some of this stuff, but... When, yeah. when the two daughters of Dionysus meet, so if the kid is part of uh, one of the Dionysus, then there might be another one out there that when they meet, something bad is going to happen. Do you know what Dionysus is referring to? I mean, obviously it could be referring to literally the ancient god, but it could also mean... The Greek god of wine Parking. and drinking. Yeah, yeah. It's not like the Bacchus... When the two daughters of Dionysus meet. Do you have two daughters? Not that I know of. <laughs> Do you have a daughter? Not that I know of. Did your queen get pregnant? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
Yeah. Long pauses. Uh, everybody looks at Alex. Huh. They shall become Janus complete. Janus is the two-faced god. Two-faced god, yeah. See, which takes us back to Batman. Uh huh. Mm. Slow the enemy with a great sword, yet at least he loses endless horde. Uh, that could be Zog, like I said. Through the twins lie Zogafoss, that's great. Dimensions and worlds filled in a swath. Or save the that's children. Bad. So. <laughs> that means threat. Save. The, so we. We doom the children, it dooms the world. We save the children and we gain some transcendent knowledge. Okay. Save the tier later. Save the world. Who's Zog? Zog is um, basically... Uh, we don't know exactly who Zog is, but what we do know is the sword I own is uh, meant to kill him. Kind of destiny type thing. Now, he, I believe he is... Um, the, the leader of a great horde that basically has the ability to rend holes um, in the universe so they can travel between one world and another. That's why Burlington got trashed because they basically uh. opened this gate and sent the whole horde in. They killed everyone in Burlington and then went out. They may have dinosaurs. Fire breathing dinosaurs. Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. So, so they're the, what, Blight Brotherhood? Yep, yeah, that's the one. So Zorg, I believe, is the leader or god of those guys. And yeah. this sword I've got with me is meant to kill him. Did uh, Burlington get just... better? Or huh? was it still screwed over? We kind of fixed... Uh, hmm. Yeah, what we did was we found a way of shutting the gate. And then what that did was it kind of reset everything. So... By having the gate open, it was like a thorn in the side. It couldn't heal. But once we took the gate, once we found someone powerful enough to take down the gate, then the the place basically started healing itself. So, yeah, I think definitely by now, Burlington should be back to the way it was. Okay. I've um, gotten, oh no, Logan, five hero are added to an NPC of a GM's choice. Uh, he is currently away from his computer right now. Oh, yeah. Do you know what happened on the Canadian frontier town? With the head on the spikes? We went there and it was just abandoned. The Canadian? Oh, what, the cold area off of Burlington? Yeah. Yeah. No, I haven't been there in ages. I, I really didn't like that place. Oh, I did hear rumored that someone, one of our traveling companions, went there and made a pact with them rather than... So, I think... Yeah, I mean, if, if that place is deserted, it again, the Horde might have done their stuff with them, if you know what I mean. The Horde might have descended yeah. on them. Yeah, it, it wasn't... It wasn't as bad as Burlington. Um, there were some burned down buildings and heads on pikes. Mm. Other than that, it looked like the people just left. Yeah, it's kind of ringing a bell, but I'm not sure if I remember exactly what happened. I, like I said, I haven't been part of that zone for a long time, so not really sure what's going on there. No. Hey, did anyone want a personal escape? Nah. nah. Dump in. Um, We're all in. I got a... Killing is wrong. Hmm. So you get a refill. Did you want um, your dissemination back, Glenn? Uh, let me... I need to do the play immediately first. So... I can ditch stuff. I think I'll ditch multi-kill. I don't think we're going to use that. Um... Do either of you have junk? Do we want to hold on to the assistant reroll? Well, uh, I I have actually quite good cards. Okay. I'm already having trouble. I'll just take three then. Assistant got, plus D ten damage. I think got, that we're gonna need that in our next. 
I don't know. It doesn't look like we're going to have... Uh, um, trusting trusting soul. If anyone doesn't have a firearm or a damage bonus, take a card. Which I think is probably oh. none of us. Yeah. yeah I got it. I, I don't have a pistol, but I definitely have a strength bonus. I was going to say, does Dana have a gun on her or a strength bonus? Uh, uh, I don't think think both of them had guns, but maybe not. World of pain. Well, don't think it matters anymore. What was that one? Everybody discards everything? Yep. Unless... Unless somebody have, has a nope. Don't have a nope. Hmm. It's all gone. That's what you get for being clever. Saying smart shit. <laughs> yep. I'll teach us. <laughs> So, what did you guys come up with while I was... Uh... Not a lot. Oh. We need to go babysitting or something. Babysitting? Nice. We need to find these kids. Yeah. So, there's like two kids that became one or something. Ooh. Or will be. Ooh. In Gothic. What do you, what do you know about that? Where it's... I don't know. Uh, the only one I can think of, of course, is um, of uh, Mildred's daughter. She would probably be classed as one of the daughters yeah. of Donas, probably. Is the... What's with the Civil silver War? Do you know anything about that? The Civil, sil uh, the civil, <laughs> civil War but for White? Yeah. Like, could there be a child from each faction that it's talking about, or no? Could be. Uh, all I know yeah. is, it, all I know is, that I think it's kind of like when the kid was born and it was obviously very powerful. Um, I think the faction split because there are some that were like, praise her, she's all powerful, she'll she'll show us the way, and then there's others that were like, burn her, kill her, she's too powerful. So, the usual. Yeah. <laughs> the woman that kidnapped Dana. That wasn't Mildred. She also had a daughter. No, I think that's the right. daughter. That's the daughter. I think it's her and it's not Mildred's daughter. You, no, well, <laughs> yeah, we we say that to her to wind her up. She hates she hates the fact that, but no, it's her partner had the daughter. So that's where probably the three mothers came from. Because I'm guessing the the. The Mildred Mildred's partner had a daughter through means of White, I believe, which is female as well in in an AI capacity. So it would be three mothers. It'd be White. It would be Mildred's partner, and Mildred would be cast as a parent. So three mothers. Okay. Unless they're referring to witches, which that'd be cool too. Because witches normally come in through. Hmm. Huh. That's only if they're hovering over a pot. See, oil. see that's interesting as well. The 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 the, the line is in my... Logan frozen or is he just really good at holding a pose? Yeah. It's <laughs> okay, very good. Very good. Um, <laughs> I've just realised that the line. There's one line that says one of three mothers. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, yeah, but does it mean one of three mothers? I'm going to minimize your picture, Logan. It's too much. <laughs> well, usually the picture of whoever's talking comes up, unless you click on it. <laughs> yep. Sorry, go on. Oh, oh, so... no, never mind. That card went away. We almost got Raj some cards. But no. Only one of the mothers matters. Well, no. What I was trying to say was, I don't know if it means one of the three mothers or one of three mothers. Do you see? So does it mean one of one born of three mothers, or does it refer to one of three mothers? Oh. I think it is the product of three mothers. 
that's what I would think, but it could also okay. mean one of three mothers, as in there are three mothers and one of them's important. But, um, yeah, I don't know. What about your kid? Oh, what, Alex Jr.? No, he's just a, he's a breaker. Yay, murder in the dark. What about your kid with the princess and Genovia? I don't even think that's born yet. I don't know. It's hard to keep track of all these women and kids. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> I don't know if she's been... Well, you know what? We don't even oh. know where she is. I'd like to point out, at least he's not saying this in blackface. That would be way over the line. Yeah. So, so that's the interesting point as well because the, there's rumors about Princess Danny and what's happened to her. I, I, we don't like 100% know yet, but there was rumors that she might have gone missing or disappeared or, or I don't know. So, yeah, maybe. So the AI might have got her? or Could, could, I, could I be Dionysus? You do drink <laughs> That's that kind of what I said earlier. So cool. <laughs> uh, if the bottle fits. <laughs> so how do we... Uh, you might be Dionysus. <laughs> when, it could be. Uh huh. So when the two daughters of Dionysus meet, they should become Janus complete. So they become the two-faced god, but then how do we save them rather than uh, through the twins lies Yogosoth dimensions and what so through them lie but we can save them by what splitting them apart again? Uh, Doesn't say how. It says slay the enemy with a great sword. Yeah. Oof, well this is all very much this hypothesis at the moment and I have no idea how to go around trying to actually verify any of this. Um. Alright, so um, Mildred posted on our inter-realm phones mm -hmm. our, a, a message with the subject, our daughter and or daughters and possibly the end of the world double question mark and she says please kill the girl that claims to be my daughter on sight it'll be difficult as she is stored somewhere very hard to reach she's dangerous I'm not lying tee hee also don't <laughs> mention the replicant to me ever oh dear in other news my daughter and daughter of Alex merged and are one girl slash white slash Janice slash goddess of time and beginnings here to help us against Zog who wants to destroy everything. Zog can be killed by the sword Alex has. But that's not important. The important what? thing is where is my bottle? The important thing is why didn't we read this at the beginning of the fucking venture? Oh, uh, God. I read it the other day. Oh, no. <laughs> and he just now mentioned it to Alex. Oh, oh, I kept asking you questions about <laughs> the daughters and the merging. and <laughs> I think Matt's crying oh. now. <laughs> yep. Oh, dear. You've made Matt cry. You, you know what? Matt. I fucking hate this insanity. <laughs> <laughs> you know... <laughs> It, what's your what's your current san at oh no i'm i'm pretty healthy in that sense but not being able to have electronic wrist watch and not being able to read the fucking boards right yeah i was gonna say you want once you get that uh uh expert psychoanalysis card or if I'm you can get somebody with psychoanalysis skill to psychoanalyze you you can at me. least get to the point where maybe you could look at the board uh, over somebody's shoulder, so to speak, and say, I review all this shit, and then you can do it between game sessions over an RPC's shoulder, making them oh, operate it. I hate but love this insanity because of oh. what it does. Yeah. What I need to do is I need to find a magical way of connecting to the fucking boards. That'd be perfect. 
Yeah. Magitech. Actually, you know of a whole zone that has Magitech, and uh, hopefully those fucking construction people get done with their shit sooner or later. <laughs> if you had anything, uh, unfortunately, you're missing something called money. Money can be used to exchange for goods. Oh, what? <laughs> like, my, like my other insanity? Yeah. <laughs> oh, all of your insanities just kind of crunched together into a fucking hard, bitter ball of fuck. Right, that's okay. Now, I've learned my lesson from now on. I'm, I think every adventure I start on, I'm going to say, right, everyone tell me what's going on in the books. <laughs> and then I can be like, yes, yes, we will not waste time going around in circles. Yes. Right. Okay, well, um, okay, so you that, don't that, want to be psychoanalyzed? No. Because I kind of want to. I am happy the way <laughs> I am. Uh, so. I have a shoulder to cry on. Cry on my shoulder. Mm, it's a bit forceful. <laughs> I like it. Uh, so. I have a listening ear. <laughs> That's a bit creepy. <laughs> I'm not good at it. Glenn is. Glenn is. <laughs> So what does it all mean? Well, Alex okay, now knows because you told him, and so now he knows. He seems yeah. happier, yet sadder. Well, so I think obviously death to Zorg is important. We need to go and kill Zorg at some, but that'll be for another day. Uh, um, quick side note, could you give me a memory roll, Alex? Yeah. Not G as in golf, D as in dog, or Delta. Oh, Zord. Yeah, sorry. I just, I'm not looking at my notes. Um, anyway. They made up with Zog. Scott kills him. <laughs> we win! Zog's <laughs> like, yes, yes, you do. <laughs> I, I, do. I must have initially heard it wrong because I've, I've written down Zord. So yeah, it's Zod with a Z-O-D. <laughs> yeah. But I think it'd be funnier if you were to send those two to kill no. Zog, who is actually a shoemaker. <laughs> and... <laughs> Yeah, that that was yes, lots of people do. I'm just okay. Actually, I'm just gonna double check my shit because I could be fucked up now. I'm getting worried. Hold on, man. Fortunately, I've got the place where he was released from up on my files. So let me take a look here. It's probably, it's probably just the way you need. Oh shit! Said. It is Zog. Oh, ah. you fuck up. Everybody, take a card. Hey. Oh, Z-O-G, I failed. Hey, was he the one in the lightsaber like... prison? He was the one in the oh, prison. Bastard. Which was... Oh. Glad I didn't oh. release him. Yeah, I knew not to... Um... <laughs> I knew that was nothing good. That was some funny shit waiting out long to tell him about what Yana yeah, put up on the message board. Hilarious. Well, I... I don't know. I was asking questions about it, and he's acting like he doesn't know anything about it. I don't. <laughs> asking questions about versus briefing him? Yeah. Different. Okay. Well, it wasn't necessarily helpful for White, but we learned a lot of other things that might be helpful to others. <laughs> mm hmm. A bit. Can't wait to see what you do. Go to the dragon. Down to the dragon. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, Alex thinks about things <laughs> like how to find the daughters. Uh huh. <laughs> sure. You guys head back back to the dragon. We'll uh, put Joshua's glasses back while we're there. Great. Um, How about his scuba gear all wet? That's mm -hmm. our scuba gear, but I will stash it back there. Make a note on the uh, message boards how many charges he should subtract. And put in a note. Logan asks that you please specify where shit is so our people can use it or find it or yeah. not. But seven charges? Six yeah. charges? Seven. Okay. I'm rolling efficient spell. No. 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 
out. Close. Yeah. How many magic points does that knock off every time? Zero. Oh, <laughs> damn. That's a good one to start with. It really is. Yeah. Got it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Smash wood. Lagging. Oh. Got it. Mm -hmm. All right, Glenn, would you like an assistant plus 10 on your next roll? Mm. Yes. Slap. Yes, I would. Last bow. Thank you. Um, let's, see if, let's see what I have for cards. Nothing. Okay. Now, if you blow this, the assistant goes away. Right. That was 400 points. No. Hmm. Um, it's two. Uh, I got a minute to finish it. That's a fumble. Is that a fumble? Yeah. Cool. Come on, draw five. Nope, he falls down. He goes, eh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do the mana trickle. Start again. Yeah. Got it. Got to make meditation. No. I suppose I have to make both of those at the same time. Right? Clearly. Okay. Mana trickle. No. Yes. Meditation. No. Mana trickle. No. Meditation. All right. I failed. Mana trickle. Fumble. Okay, we're done. <laughs> Fumble deck. Go. May drops everything. Ha ha. Or he looks smug because he's not holding anything. Either way. Hmm. Alex, does through the twins mean anything? Through the hmm. twins lie Yog Soloth. Yeah. And then it means once they're joined, through the use of them, you can get to something really bad. The end of the world as we know it. Would the twins be the children? I'm guessing the two that have joined together, yeah. Yeah. Which has already happened, so we're too late on that side of things. Okay. You've got Yog the Stoth on your shoulder. I bloody hope not. <laughs> Really smelling <laughs> Some kind of demon? Some when kind did demon. that show up? No idea. Pete knows, um, Joshua knows it when we were in Burlington. And he was using the glasses. Huh. I like how laid back he is. You know you have a demon on your shoulder. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> Who lives there now? Does it do anything? No. Yeah. That's great. Oh, with your, I forgot to mention, with your looking at it, it did seem a bit thick. 